So this question says, graphene, which is used in the manufacture of integrated circuits, is so thin that a sheet weighing one ounce can cover up to seven football fields. So let's just write that down. So one ounce equals seven football fields. Again, I'm treating this like it is a translate word problem, TWP, which means as soon as I see anything quantitative, I just make sure to write it down. All right, so one ounce of graphene gives you f seven football fields. If a football field has an area of approximately one and one third acres, right? So one football field, so one FF equals one and one third. I don't like to deal with mixed numbers. So I'm going to call that 1.33. And I know there's a bar here. So 1.33 acres, right? So that's one football field. About how many acres could 48 ounces of graphene cover? Okay, well then I'm kind of I'm trying to convert from ounces to acres, right? Because the question says how many acres? How many acres? So I'm starting off with what the unit that I have. So 48 ounces OZ, which of course if you don't know OZ, you don't have to use it. Just use the word ounces. Well, what's the conversion? How can I cross out that unit of ounces? Well, it really comes from here, right? The first thing that I wrote down. Because one ounce is equal to seven football fields. Now, that gets rid of my ounce unit. But then it leaves me with football fields as a unit. I don't, I don't want football fields as a unit. I want acres as a unit. So that's where this next line comes in. Because I know that one football field, and again, I'll just use FF for space, is equal to 1.33 with a bar acres. So now I have the unit that I want my answer to be in, the football field units cross out. I've essentially used something called unit analysis here, where pretty much I have my relationships here between ounces and football fields, between football fields and acres, but how I place them, where I place these things really has all to do with I want ounces to cross out, so ounces goes on bottom. In this case, football fields goes on top. Now I want football fields to cross out, so football fields goes on bottom, right? So I want this diagonal relationship between units that I want to cross out. So now I just go straight to my calculator, and I just multiply the values that I have here. So I have 48 times 7 times 1 point, I'll just say 33, is equal to 446.8 eight acres it does say about how many so not exactly so this answer must be 450